Fajin Marja, former Sri Lanka rugby captain and former Candy SC captain. Now I'm uh, head coach of Candy Sport Club. I, I got into training when I was little. So when I was start playing rugby, I started uh, training. So from rugby only, I started gym training, then uh, running and everything. I don't have a workout buddy, but uh, I train with the team every time uh, the team trains. So they are my uh, work buddies. Uh, normally I work out uh, five to six times a week, so almost every day. If I if I have time. I work out every time. Uh, inspired means uh, my uncles uh, and my cousins played rugby. That's, that's a big inspiration for me to play rugby and uh, start training. So uh, that's why I started training from young days. I don't have a particular diet plan, but I don't Mostly I don't eat junk food and I'm, uh, I, I cut down my oil and uh, sugar intake. Yes, uh, first uh, yeah, I had two, two major injuries. One is uh, ankle injury. So I had an operation in my ankle that was because of rugby. And, uh, and I had another one uh, in my uh, back, lower back. L45 uh, slip disc, so that's, that's that was two big uh, injuries I had in my life. Uh, it's depending on the weather. I think uh, in Kandy you get lazy very often because of the climate. It's uh, so cold sometimes, but uh, I just wake up and I just go to the gym. Whatever happens, so that's my motivation. I don't uh, lie down in the bed for long. I think nutrition is the key. You have to see what is the, what do you want to do. You want to more, gain more weight or lose weight. It's depending on uh, how what you want. So it's up to you all to like decide if you want to lose weight. You need to cut down carbs and take more protein and if you gain weight like rugby players you want to put more protein then a little bit of carbohydrate plus so you need to work on that uh, don't don't think about the outcome just train day by day week by week month by month so eventually you will get it there so put your head down and train Next thing uh, I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to do a few of my abs uh, workouts. Hi guys, this is Candy Sport Club Gym. I'm gonna do my workout. Let's go. Today we are in our gym, so we're gonna start the workout with the warm up. So we're gonna do a few rehab exercises for the back and a few abs exercises and a few ladders for the speed as well. So I'm going to start with my rehab exercises for the back. Next thing uh, I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to do a few of my abs uh, workout. So I have 
finished my rehab exercises for the back and uh, abs exercises. Now what I'm gonna do is uh, do a few more ladder drills for speed for the warm up. So I am finished my uh, warm up. I did uh, abs, then back rehab exercise, and the ladders for the speed. Now I'm gonna do stretches, and we're gonna head out to do my workout. After. So I'm gonna do my first workout. Uh, normally I do supersets, uh, first I'm going to do the lat pull down and dumbbell incline bench press. So lat pull down is for the shoulders, I do wide grip, you can do uh, close grip as well. Make sure when you pull, breathe in and when you release, breathe out. I'm done with uh, lat pull down. My next exercise is uh, incline dumbbell bench press. So I did 15 of this. So I'm gonna do 15 of uh, incline dumbbell bench press as well. So I'm gonna do 15. So I'm using 35 pounds uh, dumbbell. It's for the upper chest, the incline dumbbell uh, bench press. So. We're gonna do it's, it's super set, so I'm gonna do first uh, let pull down 15, then uh, incline bench press um, 15, then 12, 12, 8, 8, and 4, 4. That's my workout, first workout. So, next exercise is one arm dumbbell row, super set with uh, dumbbell bench press. I'm gonna do a dumbbell bench press. I'm gonna use uh, 50 pounds uh, dumbbells for 15 reps. So I'm gonna do 15, 15, then 12, 12, 8, 8, and 4, 4 reps. So that is my uh, second workout. So next time I'm going to do low body exercises, I'm going to do dumbbell uh, step up and uh, superset with uh, half races. So I'm going to do 15, 15 each leg. So next I'm going to superset with calf races. We're gonna do 20 half races. So uh, my workout is finished. So I'm gonna do abs and uh, uh, back strengthening as well. So I love to. I am obsessed over abs. So before the workout and after the workout, I always do abs because uh, I have a goal uh, till I 50 to maintain my six pack, so that's my goal. So we go with the first workout, it's for the back strengthening. So soon after the uh, back workout, I'm gonna do sideways. So I'm gonna do 20. Last exercise, I'm gonna hold for the lower abs. I'm gonna hold it for at least 45 to one minute. So that is my circuit of abs. So 
I do 25 of back workout, then sideways 20-20, and 45 seconds to one minute uh, for the abs. So I do three, three sets of that. So that's my ab workout after the uh, main workout. So I'm gonna do the warm down stretching. Legs. Hold it for maybe five to ten seconds. And go down on your knees. Try to put your bones down to stretch your glute and strength and your growing muscles. Last exercise I do this. This is my one of my favorite exercises. It uh, expands your uh, back muscles, it's relax your back muscles. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this after every workout. Normally on Saturdays I do my uh, school of rugby for skill uh, from 8 to 3 to 8 so uh, that is my Saturday routine here. Yeah. back and we're gonna throw the ball to daddy all right like this can everybody do that I always come here for my meal so let's go in Hi guys, I'm at uh, Candian Manor. After the workout, I always come here for my meal. So let's go in. Hi, this is Auntie Susie. She's gonna make my uh, meal today. So today we're gonna have uh, grilled chicken, boiled vegetables, and uh, pasta for me. As uh, you can see the place, uh, it's uh, really clean and uh, you can order any food you want. You can have uh, lunch, breakfast, dinner or anything here. So you can order whatever you want from uh, Auntie Susie, Kenyan Manor. So we'll see she's, how he's, she's going to prepare my food. Uh, so yesterday I'm going to prepare Fazil, uh, a healthy meal with uh, grilled chicken and some sweet corn. Uh, I've also put some pasta to boil, which I'm going to use olive oil and garlic, which is very healthy for the uh, for fitness purposes. Um, as you see, the pasta is all ready now, and I'm going to just turn on the fire and use a little bit of olive oil. And there you go, Fazil's meal is ready and he can have it now. So, thank you auntie, it's looking delicious, so I'm gonna have a bite. So we have chicken, pasta, ladies fingers and corn. So I have protein, carbs and vegetables, so it's a very good healthy meal. So. Yeah, 
high in fiber and ladies fingers it's good for the joints and again a protein and a carbohydrate so it's in this meal we have included everything so it's a good uh, post workout meal After a heavy workout, your muscle fibers get damaged. To recover that, you need protein and nutrition. And very important thing is sleep. So uh, in sleep, you recover a lot and faster. And I'm done with my meal now. So thank you, Kenyan Manor, for preparing my lovely meal. That's it for today. Thanks for having me, Hi TV, My Fit Life. So until we meet again. See you.